Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the 2021 Monmouth County Senior Citizen Art Show. My name is Vinnie Martini, and I am the Arts Education and Events Manager here at Monmouth Arts, and I'm also the coordinator of the Monmouth County Senior Art Show. It is truly a privilege to be able to present this program year after year as we celebrate the accomplishments of some of the most talented individuals New Jersey has to offer right here in our community of Monmouth County. Just exhibiting your work at the Senior Art Show is an accomplishment, and so I just want to congratulate each and every one of our nearly 100 participants for being a part of this year's show. As a performing artist, I know firsthand just how nerve-wracking it can be to present your work for an audience. And so, honestly, exhibiting your work as part of this show is an award just in and of itself. So you should be extremely proud of the work that you've done to get here today. It's now my honor to introduce the Executive Director of Mammoth Arts, Teresa Staub, to say a few words. Teresa? Hi, I'm Teresa Staub, the Executive Director of Mammoth Arts, and it is my great pleasure to be here today to celebrate the artistic excellence of Mammoth County senior artists. Congratulations to all our entrants, especially to the 2021 winners. Thank you to Commissioner Sue Kiley for joining us. And thank you to the Monmouth County Library System and the Monmouth County Office on Aging for continuously supporting our efforts. A big shout out to the Monmouth Arts team, especially to Vinnie Martini, our Arts Education and Events Manager, for all the hard work that he put into today's art show. Lastly, I want to encourage you to become a member of Monmouth Arts. Monmouth Arts is the leading arts organization in Monmouth County. We offer a vast array of arts programs and services for the entire community to enjoy. If you want more information on membership and on Mammoth Arts, please go to mammotharts.org. Again, congratulations to all our entrants and please have a safe and healthy rest of the summer. Thank you. Thank you, Teresa. And now it is my pleasure to introduce the director of the Monmouth County Library System, Judy Tolchin. Judy. Greetings, senior art show participants and guests. My name is Judy Tolchin and I am the director of the Monmouth County Library System. I hope that all is well with you and your families. I would like to welcome everyone to the virtual Monmouth County annual senior art show and award ceremony. I would like to also take this opportunity to thank our partners in this endeavor, including Monmouth County Board of County Commissioners, Monmouth County Division on Aging, Disabilities and Veteran Services, and Monmouth Arts. For so very many years, the library has had the honor and privilege to be involved in this wonderful event. The artwork of our talented senior citizens graced the walls of the headquarters library in years past for as long as I can remember. This year, the virtual art show will showcase the amazing artworks online, displaying the unique talent of Monmouth County senior citizen artists with the hope that we can meet again in person in the future. Every year, I'm amazed at the creativity in the paintings, drawings, photography, sculpture, and other visual arts. You are all winning artists, in my opinion. There is no shortage of talent and artistry in Monmouth County. I thank you for participating and sharing your work with the community. I would like to remind everyone that the Monmouth County Library offers a wide array of online instructional classes in art, science, history, technology, and a host of other topics. Library cardholders can take a course in acrylic and watercolor painting, drawing, photography, photo editing, digital arts, and so much more through Universal Class or LinkedIn Learning. We also have in-library art resources and books available to the general public. Stay safe and well, and please know that the Monmouth County Library is here for you wherever you need us. Congratulations to the award recipients and participating artists. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much, Judy, and thank you to the entire Monmouth County Library System for being such an amazing partner to Monmouth Arts and to the Monmouth County Senior Art Show over the years. And now it is my distinct privilege to introduce from the Monmouth County Board of Commissioners, Deputy Commissioner Sue Kiley. Hello, and welcome to the 2021 Senior Art Show. I'm Sue Kiley, the Deputy Director of the Monmouth County Commissioners. This show is presented to you by Monmouth Arts, the Monmouth County Board of Commissioners, and the Office on Aging, Disabilities, and Veterans. 
It is hard to believe that this is our second year doing a virtual art show, but we are resilient and we did a tremendous job with the show last year and this year will be every bit as good, if not better. I congratulate all the winners for the magnificent art you have produced and I hope you keep showing us your talent year after year. Thank you. Thank you so much, Deputy Commissioner Kylie, and thank you to the entire Board of County Commissioners for being supportive of the arts in our community. And now I'm excited to introduce the Executive Director of the Monmouth County Office on Aging, Sue Mullion. Sue? Welcome everyone to the 2021 Monmouth County Senior Art Show. My name is Sue Mullion and I'm the Director of the Monmouth County Office on Aging. I would like to thank all of you for lending your talent and time to contribute to the success of the art show. Your artwork is the pride of Monmouth County. I would like to thank the Monmouth County Board of Commissioners and Terry O'Connor, Monmouth County Administrator, for their continued support of the art show and the efforts of the Office on Aging. Monmouth Arts, thank you for your outstanding job in executing all aspects of the Senior Art Show. Enjoy the presentation, everyone. Thank you so much, Sue, and thank you to the entire Monmouth County Office on Aging for everything that you do to support senior citizens in our community. And now we'd like to move into the portion of the program that you've all been waiting for, the award ceremony. So please join me in congratulating the following seniors on their accomplishments in this year's Monmouth County Senior Art Show. We are excited to begin our awards with the award for Best in Show Professional. This is a tie with Michael Ferrara's drawing Women Seated and the Irish Captain in Oil Painting by Melinda Siminski. Congratulations, Michael and Melinda, on your accomplishments. We will now present the award for Non-Professional Best in Show. This goes to Valerie Ragazio for her pastel piece, Customer with a White Hat. Congratulations, Valerie. Moving on to the professional acrylic category, we have our third place winner, Beverly Siriani with Copper Tinged Trees, our second place award for Pro Acrylic to Karen Martin for Dreams, and the first place award in this category going to Anne Marie Fitzsimmons for Growing Green. Congratulations to our professional acrylic winners. In our non professional acrylic category, we have an honorable mention for Mickey Jones's Gym, a tie for second place with Janet Rittner's Ruth and Otis as well as Jean Queskin Siegel's Shore Gull. The first place award in this division goes to Chimp Munching on a Twig by Teresa Trochia. Congratulations, Teresa, and all of our winners. We are moving on to the professional craft division. We have a first place award here for Dana McKay's Home Tweet Home. Congratulations, Dana. In our non-professional craft division, we have our third place winner with Beth B. Martino's Colorful Flowers. The second place tie goes to Peace by Harry Belkowitz and also Natalia Aronov's Cleopatra. The first place winner in the non-professional craft division is Harvey Altman's Stained Glass. Congratulations to our non-professional craft winners. In the professional digital art division, we have a second place winner for Grace Schultz's Impending Storm. And our first place winner is Sturm und Drang by Bell Blenz. Congratulations to our digital art winners. In our professional drawing category, we have a first place winner for Michael Ferrara's Woman Seed, which was also our best in show. Congratulations, Michael. In the non-professional drawing category, our third place winner is Diane Del Pret's Zuni Governor. The second place winner is German Aronov's Cityscape Pencil Sepia. And the first place winner is Maurice Lampel's David Baltimore. Congratulations to our drawing winners. In the professional mixed media division, we have a second place winner for Lois Wilkes's Aging Gracefully, and a first place winner in Beverly Hurtler's Bits and Pieces. Congratulations to Beverly and Lois. In our non-professional mixed media division, we have a third place winner for Vladimir Kirsten's Swan Pond. Our second place winner is I Am Woman by Beth Stamp. And the first place winner in this category is Judy O'Connor's Madame Zoltana Fortune Teller. Congratulations to our mixed media winners. In our professional oil division, we have a third place winner for Coffee and Donuts by Lydia Watson. Our second place winner is Joel Zimmerman's Rider on the Train. And the first place winner in the professional oil category is Melinda Siminski's The Irish Captain, also our best in show. In the non-professional oil division, 
we have a third place winner for Susan Markowitz's Camping in New Jersey. The second place winner here is Fruit and Wine by Marion Dabrowski. And the first place winner in the non-professional oil category is Marilyn Shotwell's Sunny Marshes. Congratulations to all of our oil winners. In the non-professional pastel category, we have a third place winner for Linda Alston's Katarina. The second place winner is Produce Paradise by Sonia Resnick. And the first place winner in the non-professional pastel category is Valerie Rogazio's Customer with a White Hat, also our best in show. Congratulations. In the professional photography division, we have some honorable mentions for Vince Matalevich's Catalia Orchids and for Helen Antholis's Morning Mist. The third place winner is a tie here between Terry Halifko's The Perfect Puddle and Judith Mugrace's Bashful Orangutan. The second place winner in the professional photography division is Ocean Grove by Joan Myers, and our first place winner is Ghost Town Number no. 4 by Marilyn Baldy. Congratulations to the professional photography winners. In the non-professional photography division, we have an honorable mention for Fall Splendor at Huber Woods by Ellen Hughes. The third place winner is Caribbean Coral by Stuart Hoberman. Our second place winner is Sunrise from Bodmin Park by John J. Martin. And our first place winner is Barbara Withers' Queen Mary 2. Congratulations to all of our photography winners. In our professional sculpture division, our second place winner is Paul Pugliese's Jazz Trio. And the first place winner is Stephanie Devatsky for her piece, The Games of Foot. Congratulations. In our non-professional sculpture division, we have a first place winner for Stephen Lewis and his piece, Zao. Congratulations, Stephen. In the professional watercolor division, we have a third place winner for Linda Hart's Sundown Flowering. The second place winner here is Fruit Vegetables Art Moroccan Street Vendor by Michelle Rath. And our first place winner is Jackie St. Angel's Steelers Nation. Congratulations. Our final awards here are for the non-professional watercolor division. In third place, we have Melissa Rafay's Homedale Park Lazy Day. A tie for second place with Sherry Pasuti's U.S. Open Bound. And Welcome to My World by Carol DiMattia. And in first place, we have Rocky Mountain Local by Susan Penn. Congratulations to all of our winners. And that concludes the 2021 Monmouth County Senior Art Show. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all of our partners on the Senior Art Show. First, I'd like to thank the Monmouth County Library System for being an incredible partner to Monmouth Arts and the Senior Art Show over the years. I'd also like to thank the Monmouth County Office on Aging and Executive Director Sue Mullion for making this show possible. Of course, I'd like to thank the Monmouth County Board of Commissioners for all of their support of the arts in Monmouth County. And finally, I'd like to thank all of you at home, all of the artists who submitted work to the Senior Art Show this year. Every year, you continue to amaze us with the caliber of work you're showing us, and we are just so thrilled to present this show for all of you. I look forward to seeing each and every one of you at the 2022 Monmouth County Senior Art Show in person at the Monmouth County Library. Until then, take care everyone and have a happy and healthy rest of your summer. Bye.